When there's a problem to solve, just ignore arrogant people who claim that their method is the only one that will work. Hey there guys, Head Honcho Henry here, and today we're going to talk about problem solving. Not math problems, like 1 plus 1 equals 2 but real-life problems, and knowing the right strategy and how to pursue and attack the problems is a very important thing. Unfortunately, too many people in business and, well, just the whole world in general, have their heads stuck way up their assholes when it comes to solving problems in a logical manner. It takes a little bit of thinking in order to problem-solve correctly. The first solution that comes to mind may not be the best one to go with. Let me tell you a little story. This is actually a story about humans. Back in the Middle Ages, humans lived fairly close to each other, and all of a sudden, they started getting sick with the bubonic plague. Little by little, they would start dying. Now, somebody who was in church thought, well, sh it must be these cats' faults, because f*** these cats. And the humans started killing the cats. When the bubonic plague kept getting worse, the natural response was, of course, well, we're not killing enough f cats. Let's kill some more f***ing cats. And so they killed some more f***ing cats, and it kept on getting worse and worse and worse, and the people in charge kept saying, Kill more f***ing cats! You guys aren't killing enough f***ing cats! What the f*** is wrong with you? Kill the f***ing cats! And the people kept killing the cats like they were supposed to, and kept dying. And then somebody, who didn't have his head stuck in his anus, came along and actually took some time to think about things. He figured out that the bubonic plague was carried by rodents. And cats eat rodents. So the thing that they were doing to fight off the disease didn't f***ing work. And not only did it not work, it made it a lot f***ing worse. And until somebody fought against the status quo and used their f***ing brain, the people in charge weren't challenged by anybody and they were allowed to spew their own bullshit. And they even believed it themselves. Fortunately, there were enough smart humans to where humanity didn't die out completely. So what's the point of that little story? When there's shit that goes wrong in your life, take time to think about it. Don't just assume the first thing that comes to your mind is the actual cause of the problem. It might be a bit deeper. There might be people in your life that try to tell you there's only one way to solve a problem, and it's their way. Well, fuck them. Because that's probably not true. This happens a lot in business. You get some big shot who thinks they know everything, and then they have to impose their will on those below them, and so they make them do things a certain way, even if it doesn't make as much fucking sense as other things. When this happens, fix the shit your way, make them think you're doing it their way, and then after you build up enough credibility, you just gotta say fuck it. Tell them the truth, and then fire your boss. Head honcho Henry out.